Who did you dedicate this book to and why? To the guy who actually saved the Western world and, and is a very bad self-promoter, Ben Bernanke. But he why did he save El the Western Nerdo world? Supreme. How do you, how do you, well, how did he save the I Western world? Because I think that world? we were at, the, at a precipice that I think we will discover in later years where your ATM machine was a few days from not working. Okay, why didn't the government just give the money to the people? Why did they give it to all these financial institutions and let capitalism because, take its course? Why not just say, all right, Jim, you had $5 million in this bank account. We're just going to give you the money. Now well, you go world, do with it what you will. Because world trade had stopped. And what happens when world trade stops is that we fire even more people than we have. And I believe very strongly that, the, that really the litmus test is how many jobs are created. This is my issue. And we would have lost not just 10% unemployment. We'd probably be at 20 to 25% unemployment. Well, don't you think we are? I think that's the real yeah, number. Because I think they're lying. You know, 10, what is 10, a, 10% means 20%. I've done a lot of work about what the actual number is. And yeah. it is closer to 17, 18% because a lot of people have given up. Yeah. And I can show you some pretty good stuff on that because it's a big issue for me. And you're dead it's right. It's a big issue. You're dead right. Okay. All right. And, and not getting any better. No, not yet. That's true. Yeah. Not yet. And I don't see it getting better. Well, you, look, I would tell you that Washington's not doing its part. I would tell you that the health care debate, however you think it should be resolved, is freezing a lot of uh, companies from, from – and also hurting – job and company formation. Again, that's not Democrat or Republican. I'm just saying the stalemate is hurting us. 